Hey folks, it's Rithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Farmer's Dynasty and this will very likely be our last episode for a little while. Yes, I know I only just started back in here, but unfortunately it looks like very, very little has changed in the game and I don't think that there is enough material in this game for us to be able to keep playing it at the moment. Maybe, just maybe, they will add a whole load of new stuff in the future. There's been very little heard from the devs lately. Um, there's been very little in the way of updates, uh, apart from adding in the uh, the whole hired help thing that we can't actually use at the moment. Um, so, yes, we're hoping that they are working on something big in the background and there will be a big update to the game in a while. And then maybe there will be actually some decent content that we can play. But right now, as it is... I don't really think that there is enough here for me to be able to get some good episodes out of it. We got, oh, hang on a minute. Ready to harvest one grass. Uh, crops growing wheat and pea. And ready to harvest. Yeah, but the, the peas is ready to harvest as well. If you go over there, it actually says ready to harvest. You look at this. Look, ready for harvest 99.96. And if I go over to this one here, grass 99.94. But it doesn't say that it's ready to harvest. Now, the grass was longer before the autumn. I'm not going to worry about the peas. I don't care about the peas right now. I'm just going to leave them. There was a boar racing down there. How boring. Right. Okay. And, and enough of the bad jokes. Uh, now, I don't want to press escape. I want to have a look on here. And we've got a plow the field. We've got a plow the field. We've got a transport. And there was a transport down there, wasn't there? Right. So I don't want those. I'm going to leave our wife working in the garden, and we're going to go to bed. I feel that we've we've earned a good nap. We, we've worked really hard, so let's, let's try and scramble up the stairs. There we go. Right, we will sleep one night, and we'll just see if there are any fix the building quests available. I'm curious if there are any turning up. And then we will sleep a week. After we've done this, we'll go, for, we'll go to sleep for a whole week. She's fast asleep. Uh, down here. There we go. Your cows need milking. Yep, they always need milk, and we're going to ignore them anyway. And we're going to go into here. So what do we got? We've got plow the field. Plow the field. Fix a building and plow the field. We've got one fix the building quest up there. That is it. Just one single solitary. And I'm betting it's one that we can't even fix the building on in the first place. So yeah, but all the ones up in town are. I've never had a fix the building quest up there where we've actually fixed a building. So we'll ignore the quests then and we will head over this way and we'll see if overnight the grass has changed in any way, shape or form. It doesn't look like it. The peas are still ready to harvest. So we will go back to bed and we're going to sleep for a week this time. We'll see if the grass has changed. If it hasn't, then we'll go and we will cut the grass. At, well, we'll try and cut the grass and we'll see if we can come up with anything for that. Because I would very much like to do at least a bit of mowing today. We haven't really done anything else. So let's rest for a week. There are new eggs in the hen house. We will go and have a look at that in a minute. Actually, we'll go and have a look at that right now. I'm going to climb out here. Onto there. And all the way down here. Let's see if there's any more eggs in the hen house than there is normally by sleeping for absolutely ages. And it does not appear so. It appears that the egg numbers do not change in the slightest. Take that one and that one. Like that. And then we'll come over here and we will grab those and those and those and then these and these and these. Right, so yes, this is going to be the very last episode in here in this game for a little while because I don't think there's enough content here for us to be able to keep going for a bit. This field hasn't changed. Let's go and get a mower. Um, yeah, it doesn't seem like there's enough content. It doesn't seem like the game has had enough changes introduced for me to be able to keep going and keep it interesting and be able to do stuff that we haven't previously already done. And so because of that, I would like to um, uh, stay away from the game until such time as there is a bigger and better update. And then maybe I'll be able to get some stuff going in here that'll be a bit more interesting for you to watch. Because I'm very aware that it could be rather dull to just watch what's going on at the moment. Now, lower. Can we lower this one? Yes, we can. Lowers right into the ground. Start mowing. The grass you're mowing is too young. Well, it said that it was ready. It lied to me. We're going to need to go and do something else. So this grass here. Uh, well, I can mow the grass. Is it leaving any behind? 
It doesn't seem to be leaving anything behind. I'm going to jump out. Well, it hasn't left it. It's not left anything behind there. And that, it's just cut it and hasn't really done anything. It's just, it says it's too young. So that definitely isn't ready to harvest. The peas are, I'm going to ignore them. And we're going to go back in here. Because we can't use hired help to harvest our field. And I don't really want to sit and do another combining one today. Because we've already done that. The way that we can get the hired help easily is... I, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to sleep for a week. Um, is if we were to uh, restart the game. But then there's a, it's a, it took a long time to work through everything in order to be able to do that as well. So I don't really want to do that either. Um, I'm going to play... I'm going to start playing a new game. The current farming games that are out. Um, don't think there is anything there that I want to play. So I want from you suggestions of games I can play. I will prioritize farming games that you're interested in. Pure farming, I don't think there's enough material there for me to keep going with the series on it. We've done some stuff. Um, it's too similar to everything else that's out. Um, we've sort of looked at some of the novelties in there, but I don't think there is enough extra stuff in there for me to keep going with it. Um, Farm Manager, I've done that for quite a while, so we're taking a break from that one. And I've already explained my reasons for not wanting to play... Is that... That's grown back up fresh. Or no, that's stubble now. That's, that's now gone to stubble. But no, we need to go and sleep for another week. Maybe we need to get through April. That might be it. Um, yeah, I've already explained my reasons for not wanting to play any more FS17. I play enough of that each week. I do three episodes for the... Uh, let's plays plus I do the time lapse which is a lot of work and recording um, so I, I sort of I'm saturated with farming simulator 17 I don't want to be taking on any more of it or I'm going to get fed up with playing it completely and then all of the videos that I do on the game will start to suffer and I really really don't want that to happen uh, we are in the first of May now so let's go and have a look at the grass and see what it's doing now um, so yeah other games Make some suggestions. I'm, I, I'm, seri I'm still seriously considering playing uh, Slime Rancher. May is, 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 is really harvested 0 0.07. But it's, it's not saying it's ready to harvest. This one is ready to harvest. And if I look at this... No, no it's not there, is it? It's uh, press tab and look at the farm statistics. It's telling me that it's ready to harvest. It's not ready to harvest at all. It's lying to me. It's lying. Lying to me. I don't like it. So we're going to go back to sleep. I think maybe we need to sleep until June now. We will just keep um, spamming through until June. So while I'm sleeping until June, have a think about if any games you think that might be good to replace this. I will prioritise farming games, but I'm not necessarily going to go for one. Um, there's the Conan Exiles game, which I think looks really good. And um, I'd quite like to do that. And then I will consider Slime Rancher if anybody actually wants me to look at it. I'm not sure about that. I'm not sure if that is something that we would want on this channel, to be honest. Um, I've, I've sort of seen a little bit of the gameplay, and it doesn't seem like there's enough there to keep people here interested. Um, but maybe there's... I mean, there's so many games out there. It's... Um, I, I cannot look at every game. I, I literally cannot keep up with every game that's out there. So I'm going to keep trying to look through other games. But um, this is where you guys come in. You suggest stuff. Maybe there's a Kickstarter project I've overlooked or something like that. Um, but yeah, we will try something new, something fresh. Now that it is June, the grass has changed. It has changed in appearance. The, the stuff that we cut has not grown at all, which um, seems a little bit odd, I must confess. It's not, not very normal for that to happen. Plough the field, plough the field, cultivate the field. And have we got another quest anywhere? Uh, there are only three quests. Let's ignore said quest and have a look at the stats. What have we got here? Uh, ready, it's still only the one ready to harvest, and it, so it's, it's still lying to us. Let's have a bite to eat. We'll eat an, an egg or two. These have been with us since last September, so they're probably very ripe and absolutely perfect. And then we will see if this grass is too young for us to use. Hopefully it won't be. Hopefully we'll be able to cut it and... I'm not really sure what else we'll do to it, to be honest, because there doesn't seem to be a lot else we can do to grass in this game. We will go there and uh, Z to start mowing. Like that. So it does cut down, but if it's not in the field, it doesn't seem to do anything. What's it doing here? Is that... 
Why is it not doing anything? Oh, now it's doing something. I'm going up across the field here. Wait a minute. This is ready for harvest. I'm harvesting. Where's the where, where, where's the grass being left behind? I'm mowing. Am I going to combine this? Hmm. There's nothing being left behind, which is worrying me somewhat. Let's go and get the combine a minute, and we'll test that out, and we'll see what that one can do. Uh, I want to go to map and general store. There, the old machine grain head. That's the one that I want. We'll take you. Right, right, right. Oh, hang on. You're, you're not even attached. Why aren't you attached? There. Right. We'll take you, and we'll run you back round to the grass field, and we'll see if we can actually harvest some grass. I don't want to harvest peas. I'm not interested in harvesting peas. I'm interested in harvesting this grass. But by mowing the grass, it's not leaving anything on the ground. There is nothing being left behind, and I'm concerned that... It's something that doesn't actually work in the game at all, and I'm not able to make any hay. I can only make um, straw bales, and then they call them hay, which is a rather bizarre state of affairs, i got to admit. But, uh, hey, we, we, we'll work with it. We can work with it. So let's have a look up here, and bring you in. And then what do we want to do? We want to start, how do we start you up? Z uh, header on, 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 off, on, on. Um, lower that one down. Grain harvester on wrong plants, you don't gain anything. Yeah, well, I don't seem to gain anything on anything else. That's, that's not doing anything at all. I don't understand. So I can dump this. This one can go into here. You're moving too fast. Yeah, I've no doubt that I'm moving too fast. That's, um... It's not leaving any straw behind. It is putting peas in there. Yeah, I, I don't really care about that. I'm going to leave that combine there um, because I don't want to harvest peas. I want to mow some grass. Now, I'm mowing grass at the moment. It's saying harvested 2.8. There's nothing else going on with it. So let's go on to here. Right, start mowing. Lights, uh, lift mower. If I lift the mower, it uh, doesn't do anything. Lower it. Start mower. Right, I am sliding around in a rather horrible fashion. Let's let's go with uh, pressing T, and it's going to a harvested state, and then nothing. So how do I get material for baling? There is going to be material for baling, isn't there? This is, this is the whole point of this: is we're supposed to have material for baling. I can, yeah. Why? What? Is that the? Is that what? I, am I leaving it behind now? Is is that what I'm doing? Am I, is it? Um, is it actually being left on the ground? I, I got a feeling it's not. I really do. I got a feeling it's not actually doing anything. I think it's just cutting the grass, leaving absolutely nothing behind, and we've got no change in the game, and we've got no change in anything at all. And yes, I am facing the wrong way and doing this cutting. And actually, I can turn round now. We can we can face the other way now. So I will turn back round this way, and we will drive round here like this. So we we are doing some mowing. We are at least doing some mowing. I don't think we're going to be able to do any baling. I got a horrible feeling that it's just not going to let us. But I'm I'm going to do a couple rounds around the outside of the field before I dump the mower off. And I grab the baler and I take a look and just see if maybe, maybe it's like a visual thing and there is actually some baling that we can do. If there isn't, I'm going to be, I'm just going to be bitterly disappointed. All right, I'm, I, I'll be honest with you, I'm just going to leave it that uh, I'll be bitterly disappointed and um, yeah, I don't really know what else we're going to do. It'd be nice to be able to do the mowing. We'll bring this one on round. I'm quite curious why... I, I don't really understand why there's a mower in the game if the mowing doesn't do anything. That's the bit that I don't get. So maybe this is doing something and I'm just not seeing the visual correctly. Uh, I think I went in a little bit too tight there. That's alright. We can cope with that. We don't mind. Let's keep coming down through here. There we go. 
He's doing a wonderful job. Absolutely perfect. He's steaming up through with that mower. Get that little bit there that I missed. And then I'm going to do... I'll do another round on this field a minute because we've sort of seen this happening now. And then we can decide what we... Well, we're going to have to try and get the baler. But, I mean, look... I. It looks like I'm driving in the the grass. I'm, I'm, I'm stamping it into the ground with the wheels of this tractor. It doesn't look very good. I think that is more than enough mowing. It really doesn't look like anything is being left behind. So I'm just going to bring this mower into here. And we are going to stop there. I'm going to unhitch that mower. And how long does it stay running for? Ha <laughs> ha 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 ha! If you unhitch the mower while it's still running, it just stays running. It doesn't switch off. That is brilliant. That is some flywheel that that mower has got on it. That is some impressive flywheel. It really is. Right, let's back up onto here and get that one hitched on. And then we can bring this one on round. So all we need to do with this one is turn on harvester. And we'll see if we've actually got baling that we can do. So I want to press that button there turn on harvester and I press T so that it does cruise control and we're away nothing there is nothing whatsoever happening with this baler I've mowed the grass and the grass just vanishes into thin air like it doesn't even exist I'm curious what the point of it is then Right, I can drive across there, and that, that sort of does stuff. That The mower is still running over there. Um, I'll leave that one there. That one's also still, still running. <laughs> um, yeah, so we, we've, we've mowed the grass, and we've got absolutely nothing from it. Um, plowing, it seems to be that if you do 10 hours of plowing, you might be able to get enough social points to get people to come and do some work for you on your farm. You've still got to pay them to do the work. And, I mean, the, the paying them to do the work, it's fine. It's the social points bit that I don't like because you don't... It's not the social points you've accumulated over time. It's the social points you have right there and then. So, it, you know, people look at it as though, you know, someone's doing you a favour and they owe you a favour and that's the social points. And then when they repay the favour, the social points used up. But coming and working for someone because they owe you a favor that's the, no it, it, it shouldn't work like that i think that it should be um different and i'm definitely not alone in that there has it has been sort of looked at it by uh, some people uh, the devs have said that yes they are working on changing it but that was a little while ago and there didn't seem to have been any updates so i'm not really sure what is happening with it i'm sure at some point there will be some updates really hope there will be because I like I've said I want to like this game I, I do want to like this game and I've enjoyed playing this game I've enjoyed aspects of this game that I have not found anywhere else it has been absolutely brilliant I really silo disposed like oh yeah we just do that um, now do I just keep filling until it says fill does it stop automatically or does it keep going it stops automatically right that's good uh, I got a flashing beacon. Why have I got a flashing beacon? How do I turn that off? Change the camera. Uh, lights. L. I want to turn that beacon off. I don't like it. Right, I'm not really sure how to turn the beacon off. I want to go to the windmill with this load. I want to see how this one compares to the last one. It seems slower. The trailer is full. Empty it. I know the trailer is full. I'm, I'm the one that's pulling it. <laughs> How do you turn these annoying little pop-ups? We couldn't turn them off before. That was something that really irritated me previously, that you couldn't turn any of them off. It wasn't possible. Right, I'm on cruise at the moment. I'm on 33k for this. That is at least faster than the last tractor. We, we've got that. There is that. There's that to be grateful for, that we're... We're now faster, but this horrible warning that's coming up telling me that it's full. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm well aware of that. I'm not completely stupid. I know that I, I may seem like it some days, but um, I'm, I'm honestly not. Uh, I'm going to put a, a star down there. And we're going to head towards that star. We're going to go like this. We're, we're going to go in much, pretty much a straight line if we can. Let's see how well the cruise control does going down towards there. So yes, the ploughing 
if we do 10 hours roughly of plowing as, a, as to what it looks like roughly uh, we should earn enough social points in order to be able to um, get someone else to come and do plowing on our field for us um, they the grass doesn't work grass doesn't do anything at all there is no point to that so hay you, you can't make hay all you can do is make straw and then feed that to the cows as their only um, nutrients that they're going to get which is, again i would consider to be quite a broken thing in a farming game i really like the um the building side of this game i really like that you can do the buildings you can repair the buildings and you can do stuff like that that is some there's an aspect of this game that i really genuinely love i like that we could uh we we got married that was good there's another aspect of the game i really like um, but overall, the state of this game as it is right now, I don't think that there is enough here that we can stay here playing and stay entertained. I think this game is just, there's too much in it that just ends up being frustrating rather than enjoyable. And that's what I really do hold against this game is that there's so much here that just small tweaks would actually make it a whole lot more enjoyable. Now, I know they had their big problems with the game uh, being taken down. There was um, this game got taken down. Uh, Farm Manager got taken down off of Steam because some we, we don't know what company it was. Uh, but there was a company and they were abusing the whole, is it DMCA, I think, where they basically the, um, uh, the, the copyright thing. They're basically, this is the copyright thing. They were claiming, they were falsely claiming copyright. And this company was abusing the copyright process, so Steam were forced to um, remove the game until it was um, taken care of. And it went on and on and on and on. And that would have damaged the game. But they were still selling the game on their own website. And they also had, um, you know, there was still a lot of support going for the game. So it, it was still there and they were still running out the updates to it while this was going on but what's happened since i'm not really sure the game has come back for sale beyond that i've not really seen anything so i i'm not really sure what to make of it all at the moment but we'll wait and see i've got the game and it's going to be here waiting i will keep an eye on updates and so on and hopefully we will get some improvements to the game uh, some extra stuff added into it and then we'll be able to come back and we will play it but in the meantime I'm going to play something else. We will get this down here. And yes, this is going to be a much shorter episode than normal. Um, but we will get this one in here. We'll tip this one so we get a little bit of cash. And maybe we can try doing something else. I don't know how much cash we're going to get for this. Right. Uh, raise the trailer. There we go. We're selling. We are selling. We're making money. Making a fortune. 15,000. 16,000. 16 and a half thousand euros. Right. There's one thing that I wanted to do, actually, that we could do before we leave the game for good. And that is, I want to buy a plow. And I've got a plan of how we could actually buy... It is going to possibly mess up our ability to do anything in the future. Vehicle store up there. Let's go to that vehicle store. I can't do anything. I'm going to drive with this one up, just because I can. Uh, I'm going to press T, so we've got the cruise control running. And I'm going to go up towards the vehicle store up there. And I'm hoping that we can get something up there. We've got a vehicle. Now, the trailer, we kind of want the trailer. We're going to kind of um, need to keep that trailer. So we can't really just go and get rid of the trailer. But we do have a pickup truck that at the moment is utterly useless. The only use that pickup truck has is to drive around from one point to another. You can't go to the DIY store, the uh, hardware store. You can't go there and buy stuff and then bring it back. That's not an option. The game doesn't let you do that. So literally the pickup truck that we got is completely 100% useless. It does nothing at all for the game. It doesn't. It, there is no positive to having it other than you can get around the map a little bit quicker. And we don't, quite frankly, I don't think we need that. So we're going to go up here, and I'm hoping that there is a plow on this one, because if I can sell the pickup truck, plus the money we got, we might, just might, be able to afford to buy a plow. And we could just compare it to the plow that we currently have. We do also have the ability, we could sell the plow we got, but that's going to mean running back home and getting it, and getting it to a dealership. Uh, there is no... 
of the machine here. Uh, no, plow here. There's another mower here. I'm not really sure why we would want to buy another mower, considering that the mower we've got doesn't do anything at all. There is zero point in having the mower. Uh, 2,500 euros. Mower. Yeah, I'm not going to bother. I know. I'm, 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 I'm just not going to go there. Um, we've got that Jack Bear. I think we already sold that one to the, the place here, so we'll leave that one. And we'll try heading on home. I need to see what I actually could do with finding where there's a plow for sale, actually. There's not one down in this dealership either. So we'll go and have a look up near the town, which is that one I think we want to go to, isn't it? Uh, what did I just do? I just did... Oh, hang on. Where did I... Where have I ended up? There's... Um, um, um. Okay, I don't actually know where I am at the moment. Oh, I'm here. Uh, no, that the dealership is not this one. It's next to this one. I need to go back to here and not click on the map. And uh, there, uh, yeah, clicking on the map is a bad idea when you're trying to move around from one bus stop to another. So here is the dealership that I'm after, and there is the plow. How much is this plow? How much is this going to cost us? The Lemming, twenty-eight thousand euros. Now I've got. How much have I got? I got 16,000. I'm if I could sell my pickup truck, I might get enough, I suppose. Where are we? A uh, car old pickup. So if I bring this one, we've already sold the tractor. The pickup is going to be literally the only one that we've got that we might be able to sell if I bring that one in here. Where do we go for this? Exit. Uh ah, there we go. Go like that. I get 18,000... Ooh. 18,000 euros. That is actually enough. So then I need to go back to my tractor, which is all the way over here, and I've got to get it all the way up there to get the plow, because, um, yeah, it's, it's miles and miles that we've got to travel. So we get this one up to that shop, and then we can get the plow, and maybe, just maybe, we can do something with that. It does look like they've slightly changed the way that traffic works or tractors and that work on hills. So it's no longer just as quick to go bombing across the countryside as it is to stick to the roads. So there is that. I would actually consider that to be a slight positive. I'm going to leave the trailer right there because it's close-ish to home. And then we don't need to worry about it. And we will go racing up and get our new plow if I can find the best way to go. Okay, you cannot drive through people. Always it does that. Rams into them and then nothing. So yeah, we, we don't want to drive through people if we can help it. Amen. Well, here we have the plow. And we no longer have our pickup. So we, we do have to keep that in mind. So let's just stop here a second and leap out. We can go over here and we have buy the Lemming J17. That's 28,000 euros. That leaves us with 6,400 and uh, we jump back on here, and let's see just how big this plow is compared to our tractor and how well it copes with it. Uh, I'm not so sure that it's going to cope with it at all. I've got a feeling that this plow might be a little bit too big for this one. I'm sure somebody said in the past that it works quite well. Um. <laughs> oh, that is terrible. That is absolutely awful. Genuinely terrible. Um, now, where do I want to go next? I've got Plow the Field quest there. I've got a Plow the Field quest that I was working on here. Right there. So I think we'll head straight towards that. It's 600 meters away. I've got a road there. See if I can take that road. And we'll go back down towards that, and we'll see what we can do there. Because, uh, yeah, that field, but this is... <laughs> this is just awful. This, this is genuinely awful. Look at that. What? <laughs> there is no way. There is no way. And we don't even have a front weight. We can't get a front weight. I'm, I'm, ten I'm not going to drive through the cornfield. I'm... I'm not going to, like, just obliterate the social points that we have earned. Um, although, I'm thinking I'm not going to actually be able to get anywhere with this plow. Oh, yeah, I can. Yeah, I can. I can still make it. 
I can still make it. All I want to do is just dump this one in the ground down here and just see if we make any progress at all. If we've, if plowing is any better with this one compared to the little rubbishy plow that we've already got. And this will be our very final task that we are going to try here in Farmer's Dynasty until such time as there has been some updates of some kind. Right, lower, there, and press T. It's a little bit wider. Uh, it doesn't seem to drag me, it doesn't seem to try to turn me round as much as the other one used to. So there is that, that's a positive. Uh, yeah, it's, it's still, it's, it's not going to be particularly, it doesn't seem much bigger. It is a little bit bigger though. It's definitely a wider cut, it's definitely a, a wider sort of swath down through than the previous one was. And we, we can rotate the plow if we want to. Um, we'd have to lift the machine like that all the way up and then Z to turn the plow. And then we can lower it back down again. Let's come back up here a minute and lower it down like that. And T, we can set our cruise control going again. And that one is working well. So it does seem to come... Oh, we're up to 42%. It is faster. So we wouldn't have to do 10 hours of work with this one. It'd be more like, I don't know, may maybe even 5 hours. We might get it done in 5 hours. I mean, just remember, this is only 5,000 social points to do this entire field. It's still going to be a long time to do it. Um, but yeah, it, it does make it a little bit easier being able to do it with this plow. The, what I don't like is that these plowing quests, that, that so that just so much to do with the plowing quests. You know, I could lift that up rather than doing this. But um, at this point, quite frankly, I, I, I'm past caring. I really am. Um, so yes... Sorry that we can't stay here, but I just there is just not enough for us to be able to do. And the state of the game at the moment um, is going to just end up frustrating me more than anything else. And you don't want to be watching me play a game when I'm getting just irritated and frustrated with it. It's not going to be pleasant. Um, and I do want to try to keep this as a family channel. Um, so, yeah, I think in best interest of everybody, I won't play this game for a while. If there is a big update, if, if they do, like, introduce some decent changes to this game, then yes, by all means, I will come back and I will play it. Gladly. I would like to. I would like to be able to come back and play this game. But the current state of it, I cannot play it. It is not suitable. Uh, there is not enough stuff for us to do on here for me to warrant spending a load of time and effort trying to play it. Um, so, again, get into the comment section, suggest some alternatives that I could have a look at. And I will take a look at them, I will see what we can do, and then I will make a decision. And next week, you will find out what I have decided we're going to be playing instead of this one. And it may not even be a farming game, because I'm um, not sure there are any farming games out there at the moment that are going to gain enough interest for me to play them so we'll see but anyway if you've enjoyed the episode then please hit down below and give us a like and if you really enjoyed it then please tell your friends all about me get them to come and watch as well that would be awesome and until next time thank you very much for watching this is Frithgar goodbye and see you later